tutorial will show you how to append your lighthouse into your landscape file. So generally um, throughout 3D design and animation what you do is you build an environment like you have done with your landscape and all the characters and objects that are in that environment are kept in separate files. That way if you make any updates to the original file uh, like your lighthouse file in its own file it will update automatically into your landscape project when you put it all together. So think of it as you know you build a stage and that all stays in one file and everything else that you put into that file or onto that stage uh, comes from its own file and that way it saves on data and like I said you can update in the original file and it will fix it. You can see characters that are in T poses uh, that are used for rigging and armatures uh, that's to be able to animate them, move them around but you will often see that there's nothing in the background uh, when you look at these types of files. Now Pixar for instance doesn't publish its files um, but you can see um, of course I know that you've seen a lot of images like this and this is why the characters have nothing behind them in these in these project files uh, because this is the way it's done this is the workflow so let's get to work on that in blender we have applied our UV textures to our, our uh, lighthouse and our lighthouse has all these different parts so if I go and I uh, begin to look at the names of all of them I have all of these parts here join this together just to make it a little bit easier I'm going to go over to the solid view and I'm going to begin working my way from the top down. The last object you uh, join together, sh it should retain its name. So I'm going to work from here down. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to begin with the roof, hold shift and get this uh, rail here. And to join it, you choose control J. Remember, we had to break it apart uh, in order to texture the individual pieces, but now we can put it back together. I'm going to hold shift and get the next part and control J. I'm going to hold shift and get the walkway, control J, and then I'm going to finally do the last part here, shift and the tower and control J. So I've got those together and now in this file all I have is a camera, a light, and a tower, which I'm going to rename lighthouse. Okay, so there's that object, uh, it's a lighthouse, if I hit G and I wiggled around there should be nothing there very important you have to click save in order to do this okay and always always if you have not done uh, this before always make sure that the external data is automatically packed into the blend file that way the materials and textures will come over with it if you uh, change computers and things like that so um, save that file and now I'm going to go and open up the landscape file okay so here's my landscape file. It has all of its textures and uh, all of that, and we'll get into a little bit more on lighting in a little while. But for now, I'm going to switch back over to the solid view. I can look in the list here of what I have, and I can see I have water, I have a light, I have land, and I have a camera. So I'm gonna make sure that nothing's selected here, that I'm in object mode. I can see that my cursor is already in the right place, but I'm just gonna make sure. Shift S and cursor to world origin. Now I'm going to go into the top view and I'm going to go up to file and I want to append my lighthouse in. So I'm going to choose append. Looks like I'm already in a file from the last time I did this. I need to be able to get to my, uh, uh, my file I need which is in here and I'm looking for my lighthouse project. There it is. And you want to go into the object folder where you will find a, um, oh, excuse my phone ring there, uh, where you will find the lighthouse project there, or the lighthouse object. We just went through the objects in that file, that's all there is, append from library. Now, as we take a look at this, um, I can't really see it, but if I rotate my view, it is down there, I can see it down there, and I'm just gonna go into the front view, move this up, and place this where I need it to, uh, need it to go. So I'm just going to uh, zoom in, and I'm going to move this up a little bit, uh, go into maybe go into the top view, get it out there on the point where it belongs to warn all the ships coming into the harbor that there is a point of rocks here. And I'm just going to rotate. I can uh, center my view by hitting the tilde button and I'm going to just sink it down until I begin to see it go underneath. Oops, that's not very good. Until I see it go underneath the land. There we go. 
right there. I just want to make sure that it's rooted. It's in the land. Yes, it's good to go. So now if I go to my camera view here, switch over to the rendered view, everything should come over. I should have my textures. And yes, I have my textures also on this object. So I'm going to save this file. And that's how you append your lighthouse into your landscape file.